Roswell Flight Test Crew here at AUVSI Exponential 2017. And I'm here with my friend Michael Perry from DJI, who's got something here that folks have been waiting for. What is it? So Patrick, we're showing off the DJI goggles while we're here. You know, we announced this in September as a part of the Mavic launch. And I'm excited to say that we finally have a ship time for this, May 20th. And it's going to bring a whole new perspective to how people enjoy their flights. <laughs> So it's obviously a pair of goggles like FPV guys have been wearing for years now, but something tells me it's going to be a little more sophisticated than that. So there's a lot going on in the system. One of the first things that you'll notice when you fly it with a Mavic is it uses OcuSync to talk to the Mavic. So it uh, actually connects to the Mavic wirelessly. You're not going to have to plug it in. Now, you can use it plugged into a Phantom or an Inspire, uh, and you can see all the specific configurations on our website. But the cool thing is it works with the Mavic, and you can actually have two people using goggles with the Mavic simultaneously. Now, how does that work? What, what would you have two people using it for? So if you want to take two people on a, a ride while you fly, then uh, you're able to do that with the system. It's great. Now, it doesn't look to me like you've got all that many controls on there. So how do you interface with the aircraft? I mean, for things other than just steering it around. So there's a lot of cool things that you can do together with it. One is you can actually control all of the intelligent flight functions just using this touchpad here on the side. Oh. So that's like a, like a smartphone. Yeah, exactly. So you swipe through the menus, tap to focus, all here on the side. And the other cool thing is that you can enter into a gimbal control mode using uh, the system. So you use your head tracking to control the gimbal up, down, and 30 degrees, 30 uh, degrees left and right. It makes for a really cool, immersive flying experience. So it runs on a battery, I guess? Yeah, that's right. So the battery is actually in the headband, and so you charge the headband, and then you can just swap out headbands while you're out in the field. The other cool thing is that you get a really high resolution image while you're using it. So it's essentially two 1080p screens for your eyes. So when you try it, you'll actually see how smooth and crisp the images are. And that's not only great for while you're flying, but if you want to consume any, any additional media, there's got an HDMI port, headphone jack, and an SD card slot so you can watch movies, play games, all using this headset as well. Can I try these things out here in the cage? Absolutely, let's get them on. Okay, well first of all, the clarity is, is incredible. To tell you the truth, I initially didn't understand that there were two screens in here. It's so clear, it looks like it's just one big screen. And the head track is very natural. It's very comfortable to move around. That's really impressive. All right, let's try the uh, let's try the controls here. I guess you got to find them first. Oh yeah, there I can change the modes with just a sweep. There, I took a still. <laughs> that is really cool. All right, Michael, so that is amazingly cool. And there are really two screens in here. Yeah, so you got two screens and you really just don't see the pixels. It just looks really crystal clear. I honestly wouldn't believe that. It is so clear. It looks like one screen to me. So anyway, you said these are coming out on May 20th. What are they going to cost? So they cost $449. All right, and people can order them from the DJI store? Yes, you can order it through the DJI store, but we're already actually sold out of the initial units. But if you check off the, out the store or your local dealer, they'll give you updates on when the shipping time will be. All right, well, we will certainly be staying tuned for that. So from AUVSI Exponential 2017, this is the Roswell Flight Test Crew signing off. I'm going to play with these for another minute if that's okay with you. Yeah. <laughs>